Zach's Rank Buys, stocks with a short-term buy or strong buy recommendation. And now, here are more Zach's Rank Buys. Growth and Income Stock time now. Let's check in with Alex Kolb, our Growth and Income Stock Analyst at Zach's.com to get a couple of stock pick ideas from him. Harris Corporation is the first one. HRS is the ticker symbol. Certainly not a stranger to the uh, stock pick, the Zach's Rank stock pick uh, videos. Yeah, I've done this one before. Um, the it's commu- does communications and IT services for government, uh, defense, and commercial markets as well. Um, I'll start with the income here. It's a growth and in income pick. Um, Eighty-eight cents is the annual dividend. That translates into an industry leading yield of one point nine six, nearly two percent. Mm-hmm. Um, it had the company had a solid first quarter. Earnings per share of eighty-three cents topped the Zex consensus estimate by nine percent. Um, revenue was up slightly. It was one point two billion. That was up from the previous year's one point seventeen. Um, the uh, the Zex consensus estimate is up on these results. Analysts are bullish, um, as you can see here, all across the board. For the the next year, the, the next fiscal year, uh, it is down slightly by two cents over the past month. As you can see here, it went from four to three ninety eight the earnings estimate. But overall, if you look at the last three months, um, things are bullish um, in every category. And the the solid fundamentals do translate into strong momentum here. This. Um, Stock is trading near a 52-week high. It spiked on the on the strong first quarter and has maintained that level, as you can see here, pretty well, outpacing the S&P 500. All right, Tiffany T I F. The ticker symbol is another one that you've written about recently. Specialty jeweler. It's a good time of year for it. Yeah, yeah people are buying presents, um, and of course, most people are familiar with this one. And also, by the way, not just jewelry, fragrances, accessories, things like that. Mm-hmm. Um, the income on this one is also strong. It beats the industry average here as well. Sixty-eight cents is the annual dividend. That translates into one point six um, as far as the yield. Uh, it's doing well. Um, the fundamentals here are really stellar. I kind of uh, elaborated quite a bit on the fundamentals, but there are a lot of good things here, a lot of strong fundamentals. Third quarter was strong, was ahead of the Zex consensus estimate by 43.5%. That's a solid beat. Sales were down a little, uh, 6%. However, the company was expecting uh, a, a bigger de- decline, so it beat the company's expectations. Uh, strong return on equity uh, nearly doubles the industry average. And the net profit margin of 6% in the industry right now, the net the profit is at a negative. So it's beating the industry on that as well. And analysts are bullish on this one as well. Um, this is, again, all across the board here for the next couple of quarters and the next couple of years. Estimates are on the rise. Um, in, terms of the, in terms of momentum on this one, if you look at the past year, shares have outpaced the market, nearly doubling the major averages. All right. Do you own either of these two? I do not. Check out more Zach's Rank Stock. Pick ideas for yourself at the homepage of Zach's.com. Just take a look in the upper right-hand corner. We put four new ideas up there for you daily, one in each of the investing categories that is written about on Zax.com. With Alex Kolb, I'm Terry Ruffalo.